Tuesday at the Nairobi City County Assembly and members walking to a scheduled Kamkunji meeting to address the leadership crisis in the county. We are totally confused. We have no direction. We don't know who is in charge. There is no budget to talk about that uh, because we, we are waiting for a supplementary budget so that uh, the service delivery can go on. But uh, without uh, anybody to sign that document, then we have absolutely no direction. And after a two-hour closed-door session, the MCAs had reached a consensus resolving on a plan to oversee resumption of normalcy in running affairs of the county. The Speaker has gazetted a special sitting for Thursday the 9th January where the Assembly shall bring a motion to create an ad hoc committee to oversee the resumption to normalcy of services in the county government. Among the resolutions is tabling a motion to discuss the nomination and vetting of Anne Kananu Mwenda for the position of Nairobi Deputy Governor in the month of February. The issue of the Deputy Governor, it has a process. Therefore, before it even comes to the Assembly, it has to go to the party, and the party has to give us a letter. If indeed, first of all, uh, the Governor is within in line to appoint at this time when he's facing the charges. Mwenda, who is currently Chief Officer of Disaster Management and Acting Chief Officer of Water, was nominated by Nairobi Governor Mike Movisonko on Monday. The nomination has been received with mixed reactions, as Sonko, who is facing corruption charges, was barred from office by the courts. In the near future, we have, we have hope that the BBI will sort out this uncertainty with individual governors wanting to run the counties like their private business. Meanwhile, the embattled governor's woes further deepened after the High Court declined to stop his planned impeachment by MCAs. The resolution by the Nairobi County Assembly is likely to change the management of pending development projects in Nairobi County. This as members of County Assembly look forward to delivering their projects by the close of 2020. Irene Mchuma Odim, Channel 1 in the County of Nairobi.